Hey everyone, welcome to my Christmas Photoshop tutorial and today I'm going to teach you how to put snow into your images. Now first things first, you want to open your image in Photoshop and to do that you want to go to File, Open and select your image. Once you have your image in Photoshop, then you want to go to Image, Adjustments and go to Replace Color. Once you've got this box up, you want to select the uh, Add to Sample button. Then you want to select the blue sky. Once you've selected all the blue sky, you want to bring the saturation all the way down. Once you've done that, you want to select OK. Then from there, you want to go to Select and Color Range. Now from there, you want to select the Add to Sample button again. But before you do that, you want to make sure you've got the selection preview to white and matte. And also select the invert button, so make sure that's ticked and bring the fuzziness all the way up. Select the add to, the add to sample button, sorry. And then select where you want the snow, preferably on the ground. Then you want to select the minus, the subtract from sample button. And then select the sky just go around until you've done it. If the snow is too heavy in your picture you can bring the fuzziness down to something like there and that looks great for this picture but it may vary for your picture so play around with the settings and try and find the right one for you. Now this one's okay for me so I'm going to select OK. Now from there you want to go to select and press inverse then from there you want to go and make a new layer, a new blank one. Then make sure you've got your colour to white. And then go to edit, fill. Make sure you've got the contents used to foreground colour and select OK. Then it's turned everything white where you wanted it to. And then press Ctrl and D to deselect. Now from there You've got your picture with the snow and it looks fantastic. Now don't stop imagining with your photos there, you can do it in other photos like this one. This used to be like that but I turned it into snow covered mountains and that. Or this picture which is used to be a green field which I turned into a snow covered field which looks amazing for that picture. So just play around with the effect and see what things you can come up with. I hope you liked the tutorial, so please comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.